You want the best for your car? You already watch our tutorials. So the best place for the best deal is to buy from the Mr. Auto app. Easy, fast and with better prices than on the website. You will find the bulk stabilizer sway bar links used in the video exclusively on the Mr. Auto website and through the link in the description. Turn your engine off and pull up the handbrake. In order to change the sway bar links on your vehicle, it is necessary to lift the front of your vehicle and to remove the wheels to have complete access to the suspension system. Loosen the stud bolts on the front wheels, raise the front of the vehicle and put it in the two axle stands. We strongly suggest watching the tutorial, raising your vehicle safely, before carrying out this step. You will then be able to take off the wheels. Don't forget to slide them under the vehicle. The sway bar links connect the sway bar to the shock absorbers to always ensure that the wheels remain on the ground. These elements can often get jammed, so use a penetrating oil to facilitate the operation. To replace it, start by releasing and removing the upper tie rod on the axle joint of the sway bar links. For this, take a socket wrench and a 19mm socket. Repeat the operation on the lower tie rod. Then, remove the tie rod axle joint. Please support us, subscribe and like the video, that will be really cool. You will find the bulk parts and products used in the video on the Minster Auto site and in the link in the description. Take the new sway bar link axle rod. Put it into the upper housing. Then insert the lower part. It may be necessary to lever it in so that it goes in properly. Tighten the lock nuts using a socket wrench and a 19mm socket. Finish off the tightening with a torque wrench. You will then be able to put the wheels back on your vehicle, putting it back on the ground before properly fixing them in place. Operation completed. Hello, if this video helped you, like and subscribe.